Yeah. 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 My father broke one arm. Broke his, his the man's arm landing on him. Oh my gosh. Wow. That was, uh, that was 12 o'clock at night. Wow. So my father happened to just catch him go by the street light. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> Did your dad ever have to shoot anybody? Hmm? Did your dad ever have to shoot anybody? Uh, we never asked him, but he, he never, never said. said. He never said. <laughs> Just on duty one night, one of his best friends was killed, his partner. So he never spoke to him. He just came home and he was not my dad for about a week. Mm. So he lost his partner. Mm. Wow. It was headlines in the paper, but you wouldn't let us read it. You know, not, the, not this paper, not going to read it. Mm. Yeah, because you didn't want you to be worried. My dad was, well, young Michael hadn't in the picture of my father. Oh, yeah. Only yeah. my dad was a bunch of Patty's, Patty's, Patty's son. Yeah. I can see my father. Yeah. Okay. Like in your wedding pictures. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Mike Carbone. The one on the end, he's standing there with his suit jackets open, his hands in. Yeah, yeah. And he looks just like my He father. does, actually. I've seen picture, a picture of your dad. Yeah. Father, yeah. We have yeah. a picture of him we in his a, uniform, yeah. army uniform. He, uh, mm -hmm. he looks, he, he, he favors my father, I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The only one that does, did, you know, but. No, so it's interesting. Yeah. He'd come home and he'd tell us stories of how when he when he was first a policeman he had duty in Harlem, New York, and that was a Harlem. big black neighborhood. Mm -hmm. But they were good people up there. They're not like they were so they are today. So he got this call, a man came running out and said to my father, The walls caved in on my wife. He said, What do you mean the walls caved in on your wife? Well, they did. They fell on my wife. So my father calls on his thing in the police car. They all went up. And they had a, a, a toilet in the hallway. It was a, like a one toilet for four. Mm. Wow. And she was a big, heavy one, but it was just sat on the toilet. Oh, no. <laughs> you have to picture it. The cops will say, there's this big woman sitting on the toilet. Oh, <laughs> so he said... They had to brace the wall up and then take her out very gingerly because yeah. they didn't know whether the soldier was going to go down. Or not, you know. <laughs> oh my goodness. But he'd come home with some stories. <laughs> <laughs> he'd have us laughing. You lived at home until you were 19? Excuse me? You lived at home until you were 18? No, then? I got left home when I got married. Married? We were 19 then? How old? Uh, 20. 20. Yeah. No. Yes, I just turned 20. I was 20 in March and I got married in October. And then when you got married, you didn't work anymore. Oh, yes. You still worked. I went to work for a couple months. Because time. then I you had the, yeah. yeah. And then when you had the baby, you stopped, you didn't no, go anymore. Well, he told me, he said, I always said to him, well, we always talk about having children. And I said to him, uh, uh, when are we going to have a baby? And he said, when well, you make up your mind that you're staying home and you're minding it. <laughs> you not my, with all my girlfriends. We're working. Well, some of them had a baby. Their grandma took care of the kids and they were gone all day long. And uh, so when I found out I was having him, he said, remember, that's your job for the next 18 years. <laughs> <laughs> and he meant it. Pop mm -hmm. meant it. He wasn't going around. Mm -hmm. yeah. But he had a good job. He always, he was the manager of a, Parts department or a dealership, mm. yeah. and then he went to general manager of the whole thing. So he was making good money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then, then Freddie was two and a half when Marilyn was born, and she was two and a half when Billy was mm -hmm. born. Mm -hmm. Freddie was five, and then um, we didn't have Patty till much later. Yeah, we, we still don't know how she got here, but <laughs> <laughs> nine years. So it was nine years between her and Billy. It's funny, it's like, because Valerie and Erica and me are like two and a half yeah. years apart, just about, just the same mm. distance. <laughs> like, Valerie was almost two and a half, Erica was almost two and a half. That means you, you must have conceived right before, or at when she was about to turn, when Freddie was about to turn two, or one and a half? Yeah. About one and a half to two? Mm-hmm. Yeah, there was so two, much work. Each one was two and a half, which was that great. They were out of diapers, they were sleeping the night, they were... On their own plane, you know. And yeah. Grandma, did your mom work? She didn't work. Your my mom? Mother? Yeah. No. My mother was just, we had seven children. Wow. So she had a job. She had a really big job. And she reminds me so much of her making her jelly and her of Terry. herbs and her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, we had used to have a vegetable garden and she'd be out there picking the carrots. And she, my mother was always in the kitchen. Always in the kitchen. 
And well, then, you know, I always totally off the subject now. Medical charges. <laughs> you want to question when you get real when you get two charges that say medical for the same day. One seventy five and one thirty seven. I'm just trying to Thank you for the concurrence. Oh, I know for sure. Grandma, what was your mom's name again? My mother Kathleen. Kathleen? Kathleen. Kathleen. Oh. With a K? K A T H L E E N. Yeah, my oldest my oldest sister was Winifred after my grandmother. Runiford. Winifred. What Winnie. What Winnie. Winifred. Winifred. Winifred, yeah. And then my oldest uh, sister. Winnie was your mom's mom? Winifred. Uh, Winifred was your mother. Winifred mom. was my mother's mother, yeah. Okay. And uh What was your what was your maiden name, Grandma? McHugh, M C H U G H. Oh yeah. McHugh, what was your Grandma. mom's what was your mom's Sheehan. name? S H E E H A N Shane. Sheehan. Sheehan. And my grandmother was Lena Hen. So it was all Irish. Linehan. Linehan. <laughs> Linehan. Linehan. L E L E N I H A N. L E N I H A N. Linehan. Linehan. <coughs> Who's before that? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Grandma? I probably knew years ago, but I don't remember. <laughs> I remember there was a Murray, M U R R A Y, somewhere. We used to go see Anne Ann Murray. And it's Aunt Anne. She was old. Lady, Aunt so Anne Murray. Aunt Anne. So whether it was my grandmother's sister or my grandfather's sister. I didn't know my grandfather. They died yeah. before I was born. Mm. I just had two grandmothers. Your, okay. Your mom's, you, your Mom. grandfather from your mom's side. Um, you're both, you know, you're, oh, you're, either. Both, both of them. They both died before I was born. But I had two grandmothers. One loved me. She just loved me. She and I were buddies. I go up to visit her for like two weeks in the summertime. They live in New York City, a big, big park. Yeah. And we'd go out, walk to the park, and then walk to a little restaurant and have lunch. Mm -hmm. And one day she was tired. Mm -hmm. And uh, my grandmother, my aunt gave me money to put my shoe mm -hmm. in case we had to take a cab. In case Gabriel would get down and get sick, put Nana in the car and tell them to me your addresses. So one day she did, but she didn't want to spend the money. So she held a cop's car, <laughs> my grandmother, <laughs> and she told the cops that her son was a New York City policeman <laughs> for months, yeah. and she wanted a ride home. She was tired. Yeah. They drove us home. <laughs> <laughs> my aunt May had a fit when she, are you crazy? <laughs> they took us right to the door. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, do you want to spend the money on that stuff, she said. The yeah. taxi? Yeah. Yeah, she said. She was funny. <laughs> <laughs> and you know how the soap operas are on the television? She used to listen to them on the radio. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I wasn't allowed to talk to her from 1 to 3 o'clock. <laughs> but she would sit there and listen like this, you know. When the commercial come on, then we talk and then she'd. <laughs> <laughs> I used to have fun with her. <laughs> she was a devil. She had always, she liked candy. And she had all hidden in her drawers. <laughs> and she said, if I die, Hide all the candy for me so they don't get angry. Was this your mom? Is this May your mom's mom? Yeah, no, my Aunt May was her daughter. Oh, it was her daughter. Yeah. Was this your, your grandma from your mom's side or from your dad's side? Uh, that's mostly from my dad's side. My mother's side, they were kind of estranged mm -hmm. for years. They were oh, estranged. Was, uh, oh. Something gone between two of the brother in laws and nobody was talking. And finally they came around. Mm -hmm. My mother was one of the four, and my dad was one of two boys. Really, only one of two, your dad. Yeah, my dad, yeah. Well, she had That's interesting. her first two children, two boys died. Mm -hmm. And then she had my father and then my uncle Eddie. Mm -hmm. And then my dad was lived in Princeton. Then her husband died at very young and she married mm -hmm. a second time. Mm -hmm. And May was well, his father. No, no, no. So it's May, like, May had a different name. May, May's name was Egan. So she, so May was your, your dad's half sister. Who? May, May, Aunt May was your dad's half sister. Half sister, yeah. What she was your, what was your uh, grandma's name from your dad's side? Uh, her maiden name is Byrne, B Y R N A, and she married Tom McHugh and Eddie Egan. <laughs> what was her first name again? Uh, Mary, Mary Veronica. Mary Veronica. But she didn't like Veronica. She, she didn't like Veronica. Mm -hmm. and she wanted Nana. She didn't like any other name but Nana. Nana. Mary Byrne. 
Mary Veronica Burns. Burns. Mary Veronica. Burns. Mary Veronica. Almost like a Scottish, almost like a Scottish there, Burns. No, Burns is Irish. Is Irish, is Irish too? Okay. <laughs> no, it all depends how you spell it. B-Y-R-N-E. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. B-Y-R-N-E. B-U-R-N was probably B-U-R-N-S. 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 Burns. Yeah. Okay, yeah. 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 Ask me this tomorrow, I probably wouldn't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you would, Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Somebody you would. Somebody wants me to put it down on a piece of paper, and I've done it for Geraldine two or three times. I know. I forget. <laughs> You mm-hmm. wrote once. You wrote it once for me on a napkin, though I kept it, but, but I it was on a napkin <laughs> somewhere. I don't even know where I put it. Well, one grandmother and grandfather were born in Ireland, that married, but they never married over there. They met in the United States. Yeah, they met over here. And, and they, they were they were so your both your grandfathers were born in Ireland. Uh, no, one grandmother and one grandfather was born in Ireland. The other were born in New York City. Okay, so your so your dad's side had been in New York for a long time. My dad's, yeah, yeah, my grandmother, my mother's mother came from Ireland. My father's original grandparents and great-grandparents came from Ireland, but yeah. my mother and father were, were born in this country. Do you know if uh, your your father's grandparents were like like Civil War veterans? I know there's a lot of newly arrived Irish uh, that came and fought in the Union Army. They would have been like, would have been his grandfather's generation. I don't remember. Hmm. I'm going to take a ride to Wolf Market to get some. Anything else you want? We've got strawberries, we've got raspberries, they haven't even washed it. Mm, I want some cherries. Yeah, we have cherries, lots mm. of cherries, I got lots of ends. I have a few cherries. Oh, see, see the garlic sticks I, ca- I got from my garden? Ooh, yeah. You know what they are, right? Yeah, yeah, the, they're the, the flowers of the garden. Yeah. Okay. They're good. I'm also, still, I'm also nice. still getting a little bit of asparagus. We got this pits. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Watch out for your Thank cheese. you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. These are good. Mm-hmm. These are good cherries. Asparagus here. We picked a bunch of sour cherries. Or, yeah, these yeah, are sweet cherries. Sour. These are sweet. We picked sour cherries. We still have a bunch of We picked a bunch freezer. of sour cherries to make cherry pie. And, oof. Her, her stepdad, Tim, makes the best cherry pie. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We had a big cherry tree at IR with our kids. Mm-hmm. And I took them all off and pitted them. Pitted? Mm-hmm. How do you and pit these? With a little... A little paring knife. You mm-hmm. just cut it out and... Wow. And I put plenty of sugar on it, and then we threw the pie away. It was so bad. Mm-hmm. So bitter. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. Grandma, they were mm-hmm. not good cherries. Grandma, what job no. did you have in um, New York City? Who? What was your job in New York City? I worked for an insurance company. Were you, like, a secretary? Yeah, I worked with five men. Mm-hmm. I did all the paperwork. Like, they would they would be, they were $5,000 or $10,000 right, $10,000 insurance policies. And they would either approve it, then we'd give me the application, and I would fall, if it had to have more information from who performs we jail credit, I had to put it in an envelope, ship it out, and then come back, I'd go through it. Mm-hmm. I sat here, and there was a man here, and a man here, and a man there, and a man there, and a man there. <laughs> so I had five times I worked with. Wow. We got along fine. I only work from, uh... Oh, good. For a few years. You from no, when you were seventeen? Was married October, and then you had the baby in a year, a year and over. Unless I left November, my, you I had left my job around July of the following year, July, August, September, October. I left when I was about four or five months pregnant, you know, because they didn't like you got to, you didn't want you to be pregnant more than five months. You left at five months. No, you know, yeah, they didn't say you had to retire, but you but they didn't want you to be like eight months, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you were like you worked right up to the moment, basically until we, you got gave birth, right? I worked until my due date. Mm-hmm. Well, you were two twelve days late. How many days a week you worked out? Four days. Oh, four days. Uh-huh. I have Fridays off. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Mm-hmm. Oh, good. It's really nice. You get to spend that extra day with the baby. It's really nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I remember when. Um, I was working, and my girlfriend's husband and brothers, and they had a big dress factory. They were Italians. They were neighbors on next block. Mm-hmm. And um, a couple of the girls made mistakes in putting the dresses together, and so they wanted them. So they wanted they wanted somebody to put belts on dresses and things like that. And they came down one night, and the kids were in school. I said, I never did that stuff in my day. They said, but. The pay is good. We'll pay you off the books. I said, he won't let me. 
school on this. Mm. And Billy was about, he was in the insurance business at the time. Mm -hmm. And uh, they were desperate. So he said, all right, if you could have a full week. So then I went for two weeks. Mm -hmm. And that money after money coming off the book. It was great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So then one day, we sat down at night and he says, you have to quit. He said, Billy sits out in the backyard on the mail, milk, milk box. I built a little milk box right outside of our back door. We used to get milk delivered. Mm -hmm. He sitting and cries for you all day long. Oh, he said, Pat, the money is not worth it. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, so I went over to work at that. Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. Then when Patty got into high school, I was bored. I had my bird. Oh, my God. <laughs> so I said, Susan, what do you look? I said, I'm looking at the edge of the paper. I'm going to go look for a job. And he said, yeah, you, ha, 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 ha. Mm -hmm. So I saw this one dog, and it's this uh, mature woman, grown children. No children, young responsibilities at home. It was like, it said, um, some days we worked 10 to 3, the other days we worked 9 to nine to 1, and so forth. And it was a doctor's office. You mentioned this one, yeah. 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 This one was in high school. I did. Uh -huh. And he called me up, and he said, we... Yeah, we have uh, so I can come to the interview, and I have a few more girls coming. And I said, okay. So after I got the job, their son Bob, who was also a doctor, came to work for me. And he said, remember, read your letter. And he said, what got you the job was at the end of it. It said, uh, keep my phone number in case good luck with whoever you hire. And if it doesn't, I said, give me a call. And they. They put me in the S pile, always in the S pile. Mm -hmm. No, no, the S pile. Mm -hmm. And they looked down. So they said, yeah, call this lady here. Mm -hmm. So we were friends for years after that. I enjoyed it. it was, yeah, that's there's true. more over there. There's plenty of Yeah, yeah I, I, I think I'm, there's, there's I'm more curious over there. <laughs> Once you start. Oh my God, you so many of them. Terry and I can take a walk right down to the waterfront in New York. That's all I'm saying. Okay. We'll be, we'll be here. Ba baby sleeping, so. Baby sleeping. Baby yeah. Sleeping. Taking her nap. Should be as long today. It's only been 30 minutes. that she falls asleep at somebody else's house, you know? Mm hmm Falls asleep every day mm -hmm. about 11, 11 And did she stay with your aunt at your house? Or my mom. mom. No, Your we, mom, rather, at your house or her house? We take her to my mom's house. Oh, so she's just... Our, our house is still under construction, and... And then my mom wants to get her things done during the day, that's like good. cleaning yeah, and washing yeah, dishes good. and stuff. So good. yeah, so she watches her four days a week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. Or actually, not always, because some days you are off and you. Yeah, some watch. days I'm off and I'll watch her in the morning. And then I go to work late in the afternoon. So yeah. and then I'll come. Some days home. I'm off, but I'm sleeping because I work at night, so I sleep during the day. If Kurt's not working on the house, some di some days he'll in the middle of the week will take because he's off sometimes in the middle of the week the full day. Yeah. He'll like take her. and... He walks with her, and they have a lot of fun. Yeah, we do some do something, you know, go to the park. Yeah. You know. well, we were married. Uncle Fred would come home for lunch. I mean, your father would come home for lunch. Oh, really? That's nice. He was close enough to work. That's nice. Huh? Yeah. yeah. When he, when who was married? <laughs> he would uh, he would come in about ten after twelve and walk and take the phone off the hook. He sit down and have lunch and put the phone back on the hook. Because he used to go to rest. Who was it? Grandma, who was that? Who did that? Who did that? Your your husband? Pa? Yeah. Oh, and he'd come and see. Two were holes. Yeah. My father broke one arm. Broke his, his the man's arm landing on him. Oh my gosh. Wow. That was, and that was 12 o'clock at night. Wow. Well, my father happened to just catch him go by the street light. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> Did your dad ever have to shoot anybody? Hmm? Did your dad ever have to shoot anybody? Uh, we never asked him, but he never, never said. Him. He never said. <clears throat> Just on duty one night, one of his best friends was killed, his partner. But mm -hmm. he never spoke to him. Just came home, and he was not my dad for about a week. Mm -hmm. He lost his partner. Mm -hmm. Wow. His headlines in the paper would, you would let us read it if you didn't know. Not, the, not this paper, we're not going to read it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because he didn't want you guys to be worried. My dad would, well, young Michael Patty's is the picture of my father. Oh yeah. Only yeah. my dad was a much. Patty's taller. Patty's, Patty's son, yeah. I can see my father. Yeah. Okay. Like in your wedding pictures. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Mike Carbone. The one on the end, he's standing there with, him with his suit jackets open, his hand is in. His yeah, back, yeah. And he looks just like my He father. does actually. I've seen picture a picture of your dad. Yeah. Father, yeah. I have yeah. a picture of him in his uniform, army uniform. Yeah. He uh. 
Mm-hmm. He looks, he's, he, he's, he favors my father, I think. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The only one that does. 